There is blood beneath her fingernails and bile on her bones. Whoa. This is a different situation here. <laughs> hey, the amazing Rando. Watch Rando the Great construct sets with his very mind. What's up, Russell's? Welcome to Grandmother's Garden, the third game in the Haunted Cities Volume 4 pack by Kitty Horror Show. Now, I gotta, I gotta say, this is... I don't have a shovel. All right. That's cool. But how do I... Ah. This is very interesting. This is the first time I've ever seen an isometric view game, or it's not even an isometric view. It's... Enter the house? Yeah, sure. How? Okay. She likes the song of crickets and the swirling of the flies and the way the scarlet locusts... I can't read that fast! Jerk. Alright. Um, so, I guess I gotta find a shovel. Hi, Grandma! Oh my gosh, this is Grandma! From Grandmother! All the games are connecting somehow! Touch her shoulder. Sure. What did I do? Get digging! Take the shed keys. Yes! Okay. What do you want me to dig up? Examine the elderly woman. Should we? Yeah, well, why not? Sitting in that chair is all she does anymore. I can never tell if she's awake or asleep. Maybe she's neither. Or both at the same time. Okay! Right. Okay, so, um... Let's, let's go on outside and figure out where to dig and what to dig up. If you put your hands to the ground and go real still, you can feel them chomping down underneath the dirt. Alright. It's been a while since I've played Grandmother, the other game based in the same universe and same setting, except this time it's not a first-person view. This is... this is gonna be an interesting one. So I'll just follow the trail, I guess, because what else am I gonna do? Ooh, what about straying off over here? Oh, look, the garden! Possibly. Is this a garden area? Last time I checked a checked a pole like that, there was a body hanging off of it. So I'm no, I'm a little concerned here. Um, I'm assuming that somewhere, if there's a spot to dig, I'm gonna get a prompt to try digging. Right? This looks like a different building, or is it the same building? You know, it's the same building. I just went in a circle. All right. Okay. All right. Keep going this way. It's a, too bad I can't go any faster than this, but you know what? Maybe it's for the best. Wait. I haven't found the shed yet. I have to find the shed. Where's the shed? Is there an inventory? No. How do I do that? How am I... All of a sudden I'm running. How did I do that? Funky, funky. Oh, okay. Interesting, interesting. I have discovered that tab makes you sprint. What is this? This is something. It won't let me examine it, but it's something. So, which way do I want to go now? Let's try that way. Right? Alright, okay. Over the river and through the woods, from grandmother's house we go. Oh, what's that clanky? Uh-oh. It's the shed! 
it's the creepy creepy shed enter the tool shed yes okay oh if you put your hands to me angry suffocating forever being drained okay so yeah this is basically the same malarkey that we had to deal with press D to get digging Okay. Just dig anywhere or wherever it, in certain spots. I'm betting in certain spots. Like those one spots that I found earlier, right in front of Grammy Amy's house. Okay. All right, let's uh, run on back. Why are we doing this in the dead of night? You know what? Why not? There's a whole bunch of creepy malarkey going on regardless. And kitty horror show games aren't necessarily known for being the uh, pleasant stories. Whoa. A well? Examine the well. I don't, don't mind if I do. Oh well, grandmother and I use it to draw fluids up from the veins below. What fluid we get depends on which phase the moon is in. Okay. During the new moon, the well gives us blood. It's the only thing the roots in grandmother's garden will eat anymore. It clots in the irrigators. Even at full spray, I use... I used to only have to clean them every week or two. Now I do it daily. Oh, okay. Kaya. The crescent and gibbous moons both give us hemolyph. It sustains us. Grandmother used to cook for us. Now I do it. I've tried to teach myself many ways to prepare hemolyph, but it's difficult to make much with it apart from soup. The half moon gives us water. Okay, now I know which days of the moon cycle that I'm going to the well for. <laughs> it's the only time, and there's less and less with each passing month. The full moon gives us bile. Most of my free time is spent trying to find how we're meant to use it. We're meant to do something with it. I know it. I feel it urging me when I bathe my hands in it. Ew! You sick little whatever you are. Well, the well is dark. I can't see the bottom at all. But I can hear the viscous gurgling of fluid far below. I can't draw up any until I replace the bucket. Okay. Cute. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh. There's Grandmammy's house. Oh, that looks nasty. Uh, what? Why is there the sound of an ultrasound? There we go. Now we're back at Grandmammy's house. And back here where the gardeny things are. Where I suspectify. Oh, they're crows with red eyes. Suddenly, all over the place. Neat. All right, so what about digging up something here? Anything? What about here? Blood bells have gathered on the arms of the irrigators. I hate how quiet they are. Just completely silent. All right. Am I supposed to just dig and dig? I have a bad feeling. Me, you and me both, Missy. You and me both. 
Uh, all Grandma said was to just get digging. And she even scrawled it on the walls with ink or... I don't want to keep doing this. I want to stop. Something's going to happen to me. But what? Are the birdies going to get you? Is the ground going to swallow you up? That seems... To be a recurring theme in these games where... This is just a... I'm, th I'm starting to think that this is like a visual representation of something happening inside of another organism. I don't know. It's just... Ah, yep, there it is! I'm getting swallowed up. Okay. Now I'm going to be jello. The crows are, are pretty pleased about that. Um... And that's it. I got swallowed up by the ground because I kept digging. Damn my hubris! <laughs> I don't know why, but I get this strange feeling that there's a slight bit more to the game than just what we saw. The question is, should we open the game up and try again? Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Aside from that, I'm gonna call this an episode, so... I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, let me know by giving that like button a bop, leave some comments down below, and I'll see you in the next video. Hopefully, it'll amaze.